Dream as if you'll live forever. Live as if you'll die today. Only the gentle are ever really strong. The gratification comes in the doing, not in the results. The only greatness for man is immortality. I think the one thing this picture shows that's new is the psychological disproportion of the kids' demands on the parents. Parents are often at fault, but the kids have some work to do, too. Being an actor is the loneliest thing in the world. You are all alone with your concentration and imagination, and that's all you have. To grasp the full significance of life is the actor's duty, to interpret it is his problem, and to express it his dedication. I'm playing the damn Hamlet for the fifteenth time, and I still don't understand it. If a man can bridge the gap between life and death, if he can live on after he's dead, then maybe he was a great man. An actor must interpret life, and in order to do so must be willing to accept all the experiences life has to offer. In fact, he must seek out more of life than life puts at his feet. The only thing an actor owes his public is not to bore them. The writer, I think, is the spokesman and interpreter of his time, his culture, his religion, his social and political milieu. I don't want to achieve immortality through my work. I want to achieve it through not dying. Studying cows, pigs and chickens can help an actor develop his character. There are a lot of things I learned from animals. One was that they couldn't hiss or boo me. I'm not going to change the way I look or the way I feel to conform to anything. I've always been a freak. So I've been a freak all my life and I have to live with that, you know. I'm one of those people. The gratification comes in the doing, not in the results. If there is any message in any of my films, it is ultimately that it's okay to be different, that it's good to be different, that we should question ourselves before we pass judgment on someone who looks different, behaves different, talks different, is a different color. I think the term, rebel, is thrown around too much. A rebel is just someone who has the courage to stand up against something they think is wrong, even if it means standing alone. If a man can bridge the gap between life and death, if he can live on after he's dead, then maybe he was a great man. The only way to keep the people from rioting is to give them a bigger piece of the pie.